Welcome back everyone, this is Ultra Lavos playing The Legend of Zelda. And I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, I told you I'd meet you in front of level 3 and that looks a lot like level 6. Well, you would be correct. That is level 6. I uh, actually wanted to get another 100 rupees before I go into the next dungeon we're going to be heading into. And there was one more, it's a secret to everyone, that gives you a hundred rupees that I haven't shown you all yet. So I figured I would do that and get the money I need. So right here, north of where we got our first heart container. We find this little dude giving us some money. And if we go up one more, I think there's a 10 rupee secret here. Awesome. Now let's blow our whistle. Oh, I'm not gonna blow it there. I think three times. If you blow it multiple times, it'll go through the cycle. Yep, here we go, level three. So now we're gonna go buy something that we have to have. It's required to make it through this next dungeon. And we've already been in the shop once when we bought our blue ring. This is the cheapest uh, place you can find this item. the bait. Get it for 60, man. Now this item is a repeatable item, but you can also lose it uh, at a certain place where you need it. Now what it'll do is make enemies gather around it. So it's kind of useful in that sense. Certain enemies will just go to the bait because they want it, they're hungry. And you can get them all together, drop a bomb or, you know, something like that. Let's go ahead and fill our health. There's a fairy here. Let's see what's over one screen. There's no fairy here. Fairies don't live here. Well, there are secrets where fairies don't live. And if we blow our whistle, we can get in here. Now we are in level seven. All right, you ready for this one? This is actually a fairly easy dungeon. It's not too bad. I'm gonna go ahead and switch to bombs. picked up more bombs there from this room. So we'll go up. I guess I could light up this room and not drop bombs. See, we can't get in there. It's cut off. Now here we could actually use the bait if we want. So I'm pretty sure they'll gather around it. Take care of a bunch of them. It will disappear, but it's still in your inventory, as you see there. dude. Now, the one in level 5 just shrunk into one. This one will actually split into three. So it's best to lay a bomb, blow your whistle, lay another bomb, kill it. Alright, 
Now, I don't think these guys will eat the bait. I mean, they are skeletons. So they could care less about food. So we've made our way over this way. Let's see. Oh yeah, so we want to go up here. There's a secret and the tip of the nose. Now I think that's referring to the map, which we don't have the map yet, but it's kind of pointless. I think in the Japanese version, they said something about a spectacle rock being the entrance to death or something like that. could bomb up here, but that's a bait. I don't think there's anything in this room, really. Just a bunch of skeletons and slow down. Oh, the compass is in here. My bad, there is something. Couldn't remember. And we could go left, but we'll get there eventually. Trying to take you to all the rooms. Oh man, I'm into... There's a lot of places you can bomb in this one. There we go, get us some more bombs. Okay, now if we go to the left. Got some more of these keys. Come on. And even more bombs. What are we up to? 14 keys. I don't think we'll need much money after this dungeon. So let's go up again. Oh, we got some Dodongos. There we go. Really? And up here is a pretty awesome room. It's like the room in level 5. Yes, we would love to have more bombs. Now we can carry 16. That stopwatch. Now if we go back over to the right, you'll see we've already been there. That's just where the skeleton and the compass was, so we're gonna go ahead and go up one. I'm gonna put my boomerang on for now. Ha, I got my shot off before you hit me there, Bubble. And another one of these. So, same strategy. Ah, oh, we didn't get them all at once. Oh well. Alright, uh... Yeah, we got bombs still can actually bomb over here. Get us a key. Now you hear the boss noise, but we can't get to the boss room from here, so we'll have to go over one. Whoops. I did not mean to come back here. Or wait, yes, I did mean to. We haven't been here yet. I was thinking this was the other room. Yep, 
Yeah, there's a lot of these Gorias in this dungeon. All throwing their boomerangs. And... Now look, there's another one here. And they're saying, grumble, grumble. That means they're hungry. That's why we bought this bait. And you will lose it when you use it here. Let's go back to our boomerang. trying to kill us. We don't need to kill everything in this room though, so we're just gonna... We're actually gonna go up. To a secret room. Just some money in here. Which way do we want to go? I believe we want to go down. No, we want... We need to go to the room up because... Trying to show you all the rooms. There's no other way into it then. Don't worry, we'll come back here. We have to go over here first. gonna lock us in. It's another key room. We don't have the bait now to distract these guys. But it's all good, because we have a blue ring and a magical sword. And now, where, where can we go from here? Well, we have to bomb over. Now we're in the eye. Now we gotta kill all these guys so we can... That... I mean, we could do this. If I wanted to, but... <laughs> Just a little trick. I'm gonna actually kill him. Now that is the red candle. It's like the blue candle, except we can actually use it in multiple multiple times in the room. So unlike just having one. Uh, shot with it. We have many shots with it. Man, these guys are. Oh, I've only got one bomb left. I need to be careful. There we go. More bombs. Okay, we can go up here to this room. And we'll get some more bombs, too. And now... Yep, the third one in this dungeon. There's a lot of these. Look at this, more Dodongos. Really? Okay, am I gonna have enough to kill these guys? Damn it. No, I'm not. And I can't even really. This is sad. I needed to bomb that right wall. 
And I would have got bombs if I would have killed those guys, but... So now we have to try to get some from these Gorias. Sorry about that, folks. I'm not going to get any from those. The ones up here will have a better chance. The uh, red ones. There we go. Yeah, it seems like the red versions are orange versions of enemies inside of dungeons, and the blue versions outside of dungeons have the best chance to uh, drop bombs. There we go, sweet. Now I'm gonna bomb this wall first before I even try dealing with these Dodongos. Oh, putting on the bombs usually helps. There we go. Trying to stun him just right so I can get the... Bonus bombs. And now we're in the tip of the nose, so I guess this is the secret. Hopefully I don't get taken back to the start. That would be embarrassing. down this boss. He's pretty tough. We need to bomb to get a get to the room that he's in. Oh no, another Aquamentus. And he's dead. Yeah, that guy's basically the same as the one in level 1. He may take a few more hits, but there we go, we have finished level 7. Next, we'll go to level 8. It's been Ultra Lavos playing The Legend of Zelda. I'll see you all next time. Probably in front of level 2.